All right. What is up, everyone? It is March the 5th, and that means that the Superheroes, uh, or DC Superheroes DLC, is out. Previously, we have only been able to get um, the 2016 Batmobile. And the only other thing DC related was the uh, the banners you got with this and the flash wheels if you got the collector's edition, which I think come with this pack, um, this one. So we're going to go through everything today. Um, first off, we can go through, before we get to the cars, let me go ahead and uh, pull these up. Uh, so... We do have uh, multiple decals in this. I think it was like 20 customization options uh, or customization things that they've added. So first we have the breakout uh, to decal. Um, Aquaman. So there you go with that. It looks like that's uh, not able to change that color. But, no, not bad. If you're a fan of Aquaman, there you go. Um, I think they also said that you comes with a uh, a banner so yeah um there is a green arrow at the start of the top aquaman batman which actually looks dope cyborg which looks dope dc comics uh green arrow green lantern superman the flash and wonder woman so put my turtle back on and uh, let me see if you can't change the color on these. I don't think, yeah, you can. So, uh, you cannot change the color on them. Interesting. Uh, next, uh, on the Paladin, you have a Batman, uh, decal. Where the fuck is the Paladin? There it is. And if you guys used it very early to, like, when, in 20, October of 2015, used, this is, like, the only Batman car that you could have. So, like, I remember people would go, like, yellow and like black and whatnot to make it like a, a Batmobile type car. But now it's kind of cool that they actually has like a Batman decal. Um, next up is you have the Cyborg uh, decal for the Roadhog. So there you go. Next up we have the Flash decal. Uh, for the Venom. So let's go ahead and look at the Venom. And the Flash. So. Uh, there you go. That's what that looks like. Pretty cool. Actually looks really nice. And that also comes with the Speed Force boost. Dang. Yeah. So there you have that. I didn't even know it came with boosts. So that's dope. So you got your all flashed out. I think it also comes with wheels too. Um, yeah. So there you go. You got your ultimate flash car. Uh, next up is Green Arrow. Uh, green Arrow with the Hot Shot. Uh, hot Shot and Green Arrow. So let's go ahead and put Green. See what the uh okay never mind it just looked weird here with like the three different colors going on but green arrow so there you go pretty cool uh next up is green lantern on the merc I thought this one looked pretty cool so. That's pretty dope. If you use the Merc, there you go. Uh, now Superman on the Octane. Let's go ahead and make it the red Octane. So why not? Superman. Ooh. So there you go. And yeah, it doesn't come with the wheels or anything. Next up you have the Wonder Woman wheels decal on the X-Devil. Um, X Devil. So you got Wonder Woman. Let's go ahead and get the wheels on that. 
and to make it a little bit more color appropriate here. There you go. That's kind of that's kind of it. Pretty cool there. And of course the DC banner. And I think the only I don't think there's any other uh, boosts. I think that's that's uh, it. no Wonder Woman. Yeah. Okay. So now we can look at the cars, and I believe this one is might be the plank or Dominus. I'm not sure though. But let's go ahead. Actually, before we do that, let's check out the customization options on it. None. Okay. And here, yeah, yeah, you can change it to color. So if you wanted kind of like a star because you can go blue there you go and of course on the red team yeah can't get it really completely black but it's okay and uh i will shut up so you can listen maybe There you go, you heard the sound. Comes with its own boost, of course, as uh, the Batmobile, the original one did. Original DLC one. And I don't think it comes with its own custom goal explosion. I think I saw people complaining about that on Twitter. I don't know if it did in the trailer or not, but we can uh, check it out. Yeah, so it doesn't, but we can check out the boost and everything. There you go. So that's what it looks like from third person and as far as the body it it kind of feels like Dominus or Batmobile I haven't played Batmobile in a long time or since I switched to PC so you know I'm not really sure but yeah doesn't feel bad a little bit Hard to dribble with because you can get bounces around a lot. And I'm not the best dribbler, so. Um, yeah. But. I like it. So. Next up would be the Tumblr. I believe that's what it's called because this one's 89 Batmobile. So this is the Dark Knight Rises Tumblr. Interesting looking right there. I, I I might be wrong, but I think this might have the Octane or the Octane hitbox or Takumi. I think it might be Takumi now that I think about it. So this is the default one. You do have one uh, skin for it. And you cannot change the color at all. So I guess this is like the only cream and dark like army green paints in the game. Um, and you, yeah, you can't change them at all. So let's go ahead and I'll let you guys take a listen and hear the boost and everything. So yeah, it kind of has like the same boost as the 89, but like uh, a little bit more, uh, actually with blue in it, I should say, as you can see here. And it definitely feels like the Takumi. Um, yeah, does not feel 
like the Octane. So I, I believe it is the Takumi. So, yeah. Interesting. I probably won't use this one. I might use the 89 uh, Batmobile, but I don't know if I will use this one at all. I don't like I don't like the look of it. I don't like how I can't change the colors and I don't like the blue boost with like the army green or whatever. So yeah. So yep. There we go. Um actually never mind. I'm not gonna hop into the game with it. There's no point. So there we go. I believe that's everything. So thank you for watching and adios.